Hi, this is Tom on board Thalia, and we were recently visiting uh, Port Colberg in Ontario. So I wanted to show you a little aerial view. This is a nice little pond in a park near the waterfront. We were a couple streets down from this, and I told Karen, hey, look at those flags down there. And she goes, I think those are supposed to be butterflies. And uh, indeed they were. So this is the harbor here. They have a nice municipal marina and also a quite a bit of room there to anchor where the boat anchored in the center of the harbor there. Um, you'll see some nice condos right on the waterfront there. Um, these, This was part of the town's effort to kind of revitalize the waterfront, which was going on in a lot of this, in the cities that we visited in the Great Lakes. They had a number of oil storage tanks, large oil storage tanks along the waterfront back in the 70s and they made a really concerted effort to try to revitalize and bring a little bit um, more uh, appealing view of the harbor front. Uh, they're nice condos for for condo sake. So um, looking back on the downtown area here in the center is kind of the um, mainstay of the harbor. It's a place called Victoria Hall and with a beautiful bell tower on the top and this is kind of like their showpiece of the town. It's on a lot of lo the town logos and uh, town artwork. They had some nice banners along the street that were pulling in the colors from the Canada 150 celebration. They had a nice version of that with this bell tower on it as well. So Victoria Hall, built in the 1880s. It was, it's a beautiful big building, and it was meant to be uh, show the confidence that the town had in the economy at the time. There was a, a new railroad coming into place here, Colberg to Peterborough Railroad, so they wanted to show the confidence uh, that they had in the town, so they built this beautiful hall. Um, it actually was visited by King Edward VII, whose mother is Queen Victoria, so that's how it got its name of Victoria Hall. Um, this is looking down on King Street, appropriately named. So Victoria Hall um, fell into disrepair in the 1950s, and thankfully to a lot of um, motivated citizens, they put a big effort together to restore it. And now it's a, um, a concert hall and a art gallery and all that. So again, looking down King Street. In the distance is Victoria Park, really beautiful, lots of nice flowers in that park. Interesting enough, straight ahead was a trailer park right on the water um, next to the park, so it was a little bit of a dichotomy there, but still a nicely done trailer park. And that's looking back over the harbor. Again, a very well protected harbor. They do a good job of catering to boaters, and it's um, well designed to um, help you out in bad weather, give you safe refuge. And here we are back at the um, Butterfly Pond. I couldn't find the, any other official name for the place, so we're going to call it Butterfly Pond. It's used as an ice skating rink in the wintertime as well. So a very nice spot in Colberg, Ontario. I hope you enjoyed the video.